What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to put a social media animated GIF on your OBS uh, for like Twitch. So what you would want to do is go to, the, I'm going to put this link in the description. Uh, a guy made it, it's called codepen.io or something like that. Um, so basically what you want to do is, this is what it'll look like right here when it shows up on OBS. So it's very simple to do, uh, you use it in either OBS multi-platform or uh, OBS classic either either or it doesn't matter so anyways to start out we're gonna you're gonna sign in you're gonna make an account and then press fork like this and it'll open up a brand new a brand new thing so what you want to do is you want to go through here and pick which ones you want to use see like it says twitch name Twitter name Facebook name all that so here's I'm gonna these are the ones I would use twitch Twitter Facebook all that so you change where it has parentheses right here and it says change this that's where you want to change. You want to go in here in between the parentheses and change these right here. See, I would put gram of mayo right here. And then I I would just continue to do it in each one that I want, like Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and that's probably all that I would use. There's also PayPal, Patreon, Snapchat, Xbox name. There's all, tons of different things here. So Basically, when you're done setting that up and you figure out which ones you want to change, you don't have to change all of them. Just pick which ones you want. You go down here and scroll, and there is an enable button. And what this does is this enables the, like, say you don't want the Plays TV username to show up. So you would go through here and just click, see, after, basically, I didn't use anything after Twitch. So I would just put zero where this one is right here. Just put zero in all these like that and then keep the ones for the one that you want to actually use so i would just keep doing this keep going down to zero zero and etc and then right here this is for the time each network animation takes in seconds so that would mean um the changing of this image to the next one like uh snapchat or instagram to youtube the image that it takes to transfer over to it so it's set at four seconds right now I would recommend like eight or something or ten seconds um, and then the delay for the animation cycle to restart restart over so if you put 600 seconds in or whatever the screen will go blank and then it'll take another 600 seconds to start the image back over again and that's pretty much it that's all that you need to do for that and then when you're done you come down here and click at export and click export as zip and then what you would do is you go to your desktop and click new folder and just type in social media image. That's all I would type in. It doesn't matter really. And you would open up your zip that you d downloaded from that website. And all these files right here you want to take and you want to put it in your folder. So it would go like this. I would, I would highlight all these and drag it right into the social media folder and close out the zip folder. And then I would go here, click add. And you can do this in OBS Classic or multi-platform, whichever one. Uh, classic would be a CLL browser, and then OBS multi-platform would be browser source. So I'm going to click browser source, and I create a new one. And you're going to click local file. And then from local file, you're going to go over to browse, and then click your desktop where you have it, and social, uh, social this one right here. And then you click index. Index will bring that in, make your width 600, and your height is 60, I believe. And there you go, it's right there, it's already in, and you have to do nothing else. And it wasn't 60, it was 30, I believe. You could just click properties, and then switch it from there, and it's still not enough, but... Oh, that's the height, my fault. 60 on the height, we'll just keep it like that. And as you can see, it's popping up right there. So you could do whatever you want with it. You could put it over here in a corner, put it wherever you want, really, and it, it doesn't matter. But that's how that's how you do that, and that's all you really need to do. And it'll stay while you're streaming. It'll come up on the screen like that. And I hope this helped you guys out. Leave a like, subscribe, and comment in the description below. And I'll catch you guys later.